Hey, say it. Whatever you're grateful for. I'm grateful and thankful for X, Y, Z. What are you grateful for? Put it in the comments so you can declare it. Grateful and thankful. I'm grateful and thankful for love. Come on, y'all. I'm grateful and thankful. I'm grateful and thankful for my health. I said, I'm grateful and thankful, I'm grateful and thankful for harmony. Woo. I said, I'm grateful and thankful, I'm grateful and thankful for you. <laughs> what's up, what's up, what's up? Yes, grand wise and put it in the comments. What are you grateful and thankful for? Share this live. Come on, y'all. Let's get our morning turned up on before we get into that meditation. We got about... One more minute for turn up, all right? So, put it in the comments. What are you grateful for? I want to know. What are you grateful for? <laughs> Y'all know I'm saying. I'm, I'm just like, my. I sound like I got my morning voice, right? So, I'm grateful and thankful for this amazing day. I'm grateful and thankful for all that is. I'm grateful and thankful for the love that I am. I'm grateful and thankful for all of you for coming forth and being here with me. I'm grateful and thankful for financial prosperity. I'm grateful and thankful for all of the things that are unfolding in my life. I'm grateful and thankful for my ability to think for myself. I'm grateful and thankful that I just am. Put it in the comments. Tell me what you are grateful for. Share it with me. Don't keep what you grateful for to yourself. Let the world know what you feel good about. What has the most have blessed you with? How have you been blessed the past few days? What are you grateful and thankful for? Let's talk about it. Put it in there. I'm grateful and thankful. I'm grateful and thankful. All the way on your way to work. Or all the way on your way to the bank. I want you to sing this song. I'm grateful, I'm thankful, I'm grateful, I'm thankful for love. Hey, put your own words in it, though. Said I'm grateful and thankful, I'm grateful and thankful for my legs, right? Stop being grateful and thankful. Make it fun to be in gratitude. You don't have to always be like, uh, like, woe is me, I'm grateful and thankful. No, get into the vibration of what it's like to be grateful and thankful. Grateful and thankful for what? Turn up. Come on, this is all about your energy. This is about raising your frequency. We are in a whole nother energetic vibration on the planet. And so you got to keep your energy up so you can get that information that's coming through your mind to give you the next steps. What are you grateful and thankful for? Woo! Let me know. 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 <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys. So, I hope you got a chance to share your gratitude. I'm in a freestyle mood, right? You can tell I, I came from the music world. Here's a chance to share your gratitude. Yes! Moon never said, I'm grateful for all the goddess blessings. Yes! Mine's up. <laughs> Woo! Yes! Alright, y'all. <laughs> So I'm going to tell you guys why this is jamming in the background. And you guys continue to type in the comments what you're grateful and thankful for. Today's meditation that we are going to do is going to focus on our root chakra, which is at the base of your spine. Hold on, guys. I'm just happy. So, which is at the base of your spine, okay? And so, what well, I want to tell you a little bit about um, your root chakra. Well, first of all, if you're new to it, to this whole, and this sounds like a foreign language to you, it's cool, don't worry. But your chakras are your actual, your actual electrical system. This is like your energetic system, okay? And so, what happens is our energy centers... They align within the center of us, like from above our head all the way down through our feet and pass into the ground. So what happens is when we get stuck in a lot of gooky stuff and um, situations and we're surrounded by people and stuff like that all of the time, what happens is our energy centers and our aura gets clogged up and stuff like that. And so sometimes you're wondering, like, why am I feeling so bad? Or you're wondering, like, why am I, why I'm in struggle mode or why I'm not able to make ends meet or whatever, whatever the story is that you have going on. When you have a clear root chakra, 
One, the root chakra keeps you very, very grounded so that you're not all over the place in your emotions. Number two, the root chakra is really to um, help you, like, not really help you, but it's that area of stability. You know, it's our fundamental energy center and it gets blocked by fear, it gets blocked by worry, it gets blocked by anxiety, it gets blocked by a lot of things. So this is why I want to work on this area so that we can release the fears and we can release the tensions that are not allowing us to go forth or keeping us halfway in the middle going forth but not going all the way, okay? Because we know that we have another part of us which is our famous saboteur right who loves to come in when we're getting ready to do something great and tell us why we can't and create fear like oh no don't call that person but that could be the very person that you need to call um and then it'll start making up excuses like oh they probably won't talk to you oh they're probably busy anything to take you away from it so what happens is when we clean clear up your root chakra your root chakra will get you grounded it will release all of the, the fears and the worry that you have about your day-to-day -day living. And also, it will clip up your money energy center. So, like, if you're in, like, a financial situation, you might see opportunities begin to show up for you to make money. Or maybe somebody gives you money. Or maybe you get a surprise check. But this is something that you have to work on on a consistent basis, okay? So, I'm giving it to you guys today. And as I tell you guys, y'all you, you, could go back to these videos at any time. It's not like I take them down or nothing like that, okay? I leave them up so that you could... Because repetition is the key. So, the more that you do it... The more that you say the things that I say to you, the more you rewire your brain, okay? And so this is what I'm all about. I'm all about the quantum field. I'm all about quantum physics. And this is the state of, of consciousness that I teach from. It's showing you what you don't see, how to access that part of you. Because it is very well alive. <laughs> all right? So let's go ahead and hop into the meditation. All right. Now this um, root chakra healing has actual titan um, Tibetan singing bowls, okay? Um, and it's basically a healing sound that you're gonna hear in the background, okay? And this healing sound is really going to help you get that that root chakra cleared up, okay? So remember the root chakra is at the base of the spine, okay? All right, and I wanna make sure that there's not anything else that I wanted to tell y'all about the root chakra before we start. Um, All right, I don't think there's anything else. I think I gave you guys the basics. If you want to go deeper, then, you know, you can inbox me and maybe I'll send you a video tutorial that'll give you a lot more information on this. But let's just go ahead and get into this, okay? So that we can get on our day. You know, we're we on time schedule here, right? All right. So let's go and let's grow. So I want you guys to just get into a relaxed state wherever you are. Sometimes I know you might be on the go. Uh, if you're driving, do not do this. Wait until your lunch break or when you have a moment to get settled. You can listen, but don't do what I'm saying. All right. So, um, all right. Let's go ahead. All right. So, what I want you to do is just breathe in. Breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth. Okay? Now, when you breathe in through your nose, you're going to just... Hold it for a few seconds um, for as long as you can, and then you're just going to let that energy out. So you're going to breathe in the light, and remember this light does exist. Remember, I am work we are working with the quantum field, so these are things that you do not see, just like oxygen, just like... Um, you know, the wind and all of these things, they exist. You don't see them, but they are there, okay? And so, um, <clears throat> we are just going to take in a deep breath and what i want you to do is just see sense and feel this love energy this loving white light and just breathe that 